Hello everyone, welcome to our YouTube channel and I hope you are doing well. Today my video topic is how you can link your TR2PR application in a GC key account. So stay with me and watch all the video to get all the information. So first of all, you will open your GC key account and you will find on the home page link your application to your account. So after clicking on that, you will see a page open link and exciting application to this account. And uh, if you have a dependent or anyone in your file, you can add everyone in uh, one account. So what program you applied? So we will go to permanent residence. And in under subcategory, you can find here all the classes. So on the bottom, you'll see TR to PR pathway. Application detail. So we have to select one option only. So people not received yet AOR, they will not have an application number. So they can try to find them application by using family name, given name and date of birth. Or there is another option, find with the unique client identifier that's called UCI number and family name. So UCI number you can find on your work permit, study permit. It will be always stay the same when you came to Canada and applied your first visa. So both option will be the same. We'll use uh, UCA number and family name. So some UCA numbers comes with eight digits and some is ten digits. So don't need to leave a space. I'm going to use a random inf information. Make sure you check your own and uh, write yours one. Family name known as the last name as well. And there is applicant personal information. So we have to choose only one option. We can give a passport details or place of birth. So passport number. country the issue date and the expiry date These all passport details you can find on your passport. Provide the following information. So 
so these are the details when you send your application everyone chose these details for example on mine it was uh, British Columbia and the city name this is for your status if you're single married whatever you just mention in your file so choose one after putting your all details make sure to go through with it one more time and your details should be the correct here we choose the passport option if you choose the date of birth so date of birth they are asking for the city or town so make sure you exactly write the same from your passport if it's like that write it exactly same for example like this some people may be having two letters only so write it as it is on your passport and after doing everything click on search for my application So this is telling uh, they are not able to find our account. Maybe the reason can be your file still not opened by the anyone in office, or they not allowed you, like um, make your AOR or check one more time your uh, details. And for TR to PR applications, you have to try all the time. Always try to do it after two, three days because this is the only best way to find your application. Sometime even they start working, but they not maybe send you AOR on the same time. So this way you will be able to find your application and you can get your AOR right away in the account and get all the details how they are processing your medical updated or any other details about the eligibility background everything you can find in now inside the account are they requesting any documents anything if you will be able to find your application then these details will show front of you so click on link my application so this can work for you and after that application successfully registration done and you can go to home page and see all your application details I hope after watching this video you will be able to link your application and uh, if you have any question uh, please let me know in comment I will try my best to reply you as soon as possible and hope for the best and please don't forget to subscribe my channel because uh, it can help me to grow my channel as well thank you so much